Hey everybody, today we're going to do a midweek tech. Midweek tech's all about countering those annoying decks that we run into on the ladder that just make us angry because they're, they have a strategy that feels like it's impossible to counter or very annoying to counter. Last week it was weather, this week it happens to be unit poor decks. A good card to counter unit poor decks that rely on bronze cards is spares and a uh, higher vampire. This video is going to look at spares specifically. So how do you use spares against these unit poor decks like Spell, Scoia'tael, and Reaver, or Henselt? Well, first, you wait until they've buffed whatever card in their hand is sufficiently uh, to the extent that you can play a card like Cynthia. Cynthia will pick out one of the examples in their hand. If it's Henselt, they're, not, they're going to try to keep as few of those cards in their hand, so they're going to keep mulliganing them back to their deck. And then follow up with spheres here. And then you put all those into the graveyard, and then suddenly they only have one card in their hand that they can use for this strategy. Uh, I put it in a pretty budget uh, reveal deck. I don't have Leo Bonhart in here. Uh, he's a very good card in reveal archetype. Uh, there are other things that you can put in here instead of that. Uh, the cards that I have in this list, like, where is he? Uh, Peter here. He's a really strong card, can eliminate like if you're playing spotter versus spot, um, reveal versus reveal, you can kill a spotter with uh, Peter pretty effectively. I think reveal is a good combo with spheres because you just want to get, you want to find that card in their hand as soon as possible and then get rid of them so that your opponent just loses their win condition and you win the game. Without further ado, I'm going to show you a ranked game using spares as to disrupt your opponent's win condition. Okay, Henselt. against Henselt, uh, we Not should have... battles need There's a card I don't have that would be very good against Henselt. And sometimes you just don't have the card you need. Uh, Cynthia will be good against Henselt. Uh, oh, Schwerz will be very excellent. So we're going to push out a spotter. We're going to push out another spotter. We're going to push out the Imperial Golem. We're now going to look at all our cards. We have a pretty good starting hand. We're going to go for a tempo play. You can probably guess what my opponent's playing in his hand. Uh, with this. If it's peace you desire, prepare for war. We know what our opponent's playing. We need to dig as deep as we can to get it. Off to the front yet again. Can't find it. And uh, then we'll have to just look deep within ourselves to find it. It was a 27 point play. Oh, I made the mistake again where I put more van into the front row. It wouldn't have made a difference here because it's still more than uh, 20 points in this row. But you should try to avoid Geralt Igni as much as possible. Now, if he plays um, Henselt on that, he will not win with a single card, and we'll just pass. Because our opponent's going to have to do at least two cards. It's really hard to get um, 21 points with a single card. Never be imprisoned again. Okay. He's used a gold card. Which is probably not a smart idea in this scenario. Because he's not only is he losing tons of card advantage. I told you so, you idiot. Okay. Try I really don't want to deal with those, so the more of those he pulls out of his deck, the better. Okay. 
The next round, we'll be trying to get Roach out of our hands. Okay. Oh, Spares is a really good card to have gotten. Uh, we, we can actually use Renew now, which is great. Uh, we'll probably push out one of the Nilf Guardian Knights. There you go. So our opponent will go first. Uh, I shall do what I must. We're going to reveal as much of our opponent's hand as possible. Ah, this is an excellent time for our opponent. If our opponent passes, our opponent passes. If they don't pass, they're going to lose quite horribly. Okay, it's time to. This is where. Got no idea the mess you just made for yourself. <laughs> Come on, stalkers, we ride. We push those two into his graveyard. Now, he might have an Ineke, so that's one thing to think about. Okay. Uh, we can't pass, but we can lock that if we want to. I would rather wait a little longer, so we're going to Notice. do this. All roads lead to Nilfgaard! Since it's not the um, cornerstone of this deck, and we need to have the uh, protection comes with, because we're gonna we're not going to get scorched easily. We're not going to play into the scorch. Uh, we do want to use Vatier to get two cards at least. Okay, and we can pass safely. Now, if our opponent uses Neneke, which they might. We can survive that, I think. Okay. Playing Ox would have been great, but eh, you know, you can't win them all. Uh, we'll push out you. Okay. We don't want to play Avalok until the round's over. I knew you would ask for this. We're just going to reveal these for now. I know it's going not going to do any damage. So we know he has that these cards in his hand. We do not know about this. We do not want to play Avalok until it will not proc on anything. If he plays that card, we're going Let's to lock it. Up now. Okay. Time to Who lock it. We don't want him getting any buffs out of it. You want peace? Fight for it. Oh, that's actually a really cool combo. Long live, etc., etc. Maybe I should have waited longer. Best give up now. Because those cards are pretty cool in what they do. Uh, we don't want to get scorched. Actually, this is bad. <laughs> I messed up. I should have been hitting um, Trollolol. If he ignies, he's screwed. Don't recognize your old mates. Tell me what you've got. We're going to play this. This will negate the buff that he's getting from that. Should have played that sooner. Just didn't think about it. Was worried about his last card in his hand. Uh, yeah. My world, my rules. You're gonna go with lower than five or higher than five? Lower than five, higher than five. Did I draw it? Lower than five? Nope. <laughs> uh. Okay, let's let's continue our little game. Curses. Yeah. 
Yeah. Let's get this. He's over not getting with. any buffs from that. Oh, I forgot to uh, like play this, device. but it doesn't bother me at all. I should have played it sooner. Okay. Let's play you. I'll never be imprisoned again. And we're going to try to kill that. And unfortunately, we don't. Oh, we do get it. He can't. Well, he can scorch. Actually, now I think about it, he gets more out of it, but not enough to win the game. <laughs> and we win! Victory! I should have just played the uh, Treb. Would have been fine. Ah, 49 points. We're the best. It was a really good game. <laughs> so I ranked up uh, pretty easily. Uh, I'm not going to admit what deck I was playing because you guys would get mad. <laughs> well, let's see if I get any legendaries. I'm thinking of streaming either later tonight or tomorrow. Now for more. Uh, I got premiums of those cards, that's why I'm not getting them. I own a premium version of this, so... Don't need to get the uh, regular. Come on, let's see if we get a legendary! It's been a long time and we know that there's a pity timer. Yeah, well, I did get a card I didn't own. Two epics and a rare is pretty good. It's, well, a rare is guaranteed, of course. But getting two epics is pretty good. See you guys later.